think we need to step back and ask ourselves, what do people like about cars? You don't like cars? I mean, they're fine. Sometimes I'm in a place and I need to go to another place and cars help me do that. Oh, American Auto is a workplace comedy, which is about an automotive firm who's just hired its first female CEO and her fledgling group of executives. I'd like to think of all of you guys as musicians, and I am just the conductor. Choo-choo! All aboard! All right, is she not that kind of conductor? Okay, well, it still works, though. Works either way. We're a bunch of people who work for a car company, but we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> I don't know if you've read some of the negative press. We need to change the story. What if you told people you're pregnant? At your age, it would be shocking. Like, people would be scared for you. I play the newly appointed CEO, but she doesn't know very much about cars. <laughs> she knows nothing about the auto industry. Oh, that's my Uber. I don't know how to drive. When I read it, I thought it was the most all-American thing I've read in a very long time. I believe that all of these people don't think the same way, they don't vote the same way, which always makes for fun, conflict-driven comedy. It's my family's name tied to this company. It's been tied to worse. Like what? Blood diamonds. Nazi. Sex stuff. Malcolm X assassination. These characters are all quite imperfect. They're trying their best, but their best is not very good. Ladies and gentlemen, the car of the future. What do you think? It looks like something Bjork would drive to the Oscars. Scratch that. It looks like if Bjork were driving to the Oscars and got into a head-on collision with Blossom on the way to prom, and then the car was reassembled by a blind villager from a tribe that had never seen technology, and a spider on LSD who also had bad taste. It, it, it tested well. How about that? I grew up watching Anna. She's a comedic icon. She's so funny. Let's sell the crap out of this car. I think the audience is gonna like the show just because it's funny. Like, I don't know, it's not that deep. It's just like, it's funny, you're gonna laugh. I cannot do this anymore. I don't think that we should be talking about this in front of... You put the call on mute. Did you want to put us on mute? Because that's different than putting the call on mute. This is a great cast. We are all getting along really well. This is the most fun I've ever had at a job. <laughs> They're all so talented, and I just feel lucky to be a part of this cast. Someone bring me up to speed on this self-driving car. Where's the brake? Don't need one. Watch. Stop. It'll, it'll stop, stop it. Stop, stop, stop it. There's no brake. Stop. Ah! Um.